Here, hot chocolate. Thanks. Kuni, do you ever plan to go back home? No. She doesn't even see me as her son. Why bother going back to that place? Not after what she said to me. Kuni, your mother is regretting what she said. No she doesn't, her only regret is having me. I know it's her fault for saying that but you don't know what she has been through. She worked her way up from normal police officer to the chief in less than 10 years. She always asked me to take care of you because you'll see me as her. But you are not her. You are nicer than her. She is just mean and stubborn. Giggle. Is there anything funny about it? You sounded and looked just like her. Well, like mother like son. Can't blame you though. Let me tell you a story about your mother. After she is in a relationship with your father, me and your grandma asked her to leave the man because we sense that he is not a good man. But they ended up marrying each other and having you too. After that your father suddenly disappeared, making me confused and sad. She became angry and tried to do everything by herself. She starts from zero and works her way up to what she's now. She always hated your father. But seeing you reminded her of him. We are nothing alike. See there it is again. You should go back tomorrow. She already knows she was wrong. No, I don't want to. I'm... I'm scared. Of disappointing her again. It's okay Kuni. I can't even tell her that I like this one girl since she will say that she's not from a big fame family. You can work your way there. Aunt Makoto will always support you. Thank you, Aunt Makoto. Also, don't knock her up just like how your mother got knocked up. Wah. I wouldn't do that. I'm still a virgin. Just like your mother when she got into the mess. Can I know this girl? Yeah, sure. Show her a pic of Mona. This is her. Ah, she looks so cute. The reason I joined the band is because I want to impress her. And I DK if it's work or not. It's okay, I will always support you. Thanks. And we are having a concert in a few months. Can you come and watch me? Yeah sure, I will be there. They talk about Mona for a while. Aunt Makoto. Hem. I feel sleepy. You can sleep in my guest room. Go up there. Good night Aunt Makoto. Yan. Good night Kuni-chan. After he goes to sleep. Hey, did you hear him? Walks out from a corner. Yeah I did. He did all of that just to impress you. But you kept ruining it. You are just like a classic Asian parents. Always having a high expectation from them. Just give him a normal life. A loving mother that he deserves. Yeah I guess. No you must. He needs you. You better start treating him well or else the worst things happen that I can't even help. Understood. Understood. After having a long chat. Hey, you should go back now. It's already 1 AM. Can I see him first before I go back? Yeah just don't wake him up. All right. Walks upstairs to the room. Sit next to him. I'm sorry my son. I'm ashamed of myself. M mom. Shocked. Is he awake? M mom. Don't leave me. I promise L will do better. He's sleep talking. Mom. I'm. Elm sorry for. For disappointing you and. And everyone. I'm useless. Don't leave me. I just want to be with you. I wanna be your son. Tears dropping. I'm sorry, my son. I have failed you. You are never a failure. Your mother is. I'm sorry for mistreating you. After she left the room. Wipe the tears. Never know you could cry. Shut up. Still stubborn as always. And yet I have a son and a daughter. Where are my niece and nephew? No. Singles forever. Maybe you could adopt him. He even deemed you that you are his, mother. Hey, you know that I can't. Even if I want to adopt him I can't. It doesn't feel right. At the end he is still your son. Don't fail him even if he fails you. Understood. 
The next morning. Wake up Kuni Chan. I'm five more minutes. It's already 10 a.m. Wakes up tiredly and looks at his phone. It's only nine. Well still, it's late. And I make breakfast. Go eat it while it's warm. Ah, fine. After breakfast. I send you back later on. No need to. I can handle this myself. Then handle it like a grown-up. Fine. Doubt she will listen to me anyways. Just try it. It's okay if she didn't listen. At least you told her. It's okay you fail, you can always come here to your Aunt Makoto. Thanks Aunt Makoto. After breakfast, he went back home. Sai fk this shit. Just get it over with. Enters the house. Sees a sleeping on the dining table. Must be waiting for me. She must be hungry. Wears an apron. What should I cook? Hem. Well it's not gonna be something sweet even though mom likes it. Maybe just something simple. Easy and healthy. Walks downstairs and. Yawn. Mom, what's for breakfast? Mom is still sleeping. Ni San Yu. You're here. Duh, where would I be? Ni San, mom cried last night after you ran away from home. She ran to Aunt Makoto and told her. I'm aware of that. She cares about you. I don't know. But I already prepared for the worst. If she still hates me then I, to leave the house. Oh. Good luck. I guess. I'll go out first, I'm going to a mall nearby with my friends. Don't care. I know you care. Ah. Uh, go out with her friends. Well, I can go out with those, idiots but I chose not to. Yan. Morning. Yan morning. Kate Cooney, is that you? Yes mom, it's me. Hugs him. Tears drop. I'm. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that to you. Mom. I'm sorry as well. I don't know that you are hard working for this home in the past. I'm selfish. I only think for myself. No. After your father left, I was confused and sad. Elle even tried to leave you both outside the cathedral but listening to your crying makes me feel like a monster. I can't leave you both there. Then I decided to be a hard-working mother but I ignored your growth and achievement during the time. I didn't even try to understand your feelings. I'm a failure as a mother. I'm sorry, I won't bother with your life anymore. I'll support your decision all the way from now on. Mom. Enough. I know that you are trying to make me live up to her expectations. But I'm not that good on everything. I'm just a child that is worse than average children. And I tried my best but still not enough to impress you. After that I gave up on everything and live my life as a failure. No. You are not a failure. Your mother is. Can you forgive me? Mom. I already have forgave you. I'm not some heartless jerk. I just want to live a normal life. With you and my little sister. Cooney. Mom I love you. Tears drop and hugs him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mom, it's okay.